Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is part two of my trilogy. Today I'm going to be doing the eyeshadows that I reach for over fall and winter time. So let's just get into it. So the first one is by MAC and it is their eyeshadow in the shade Cranberry. And it's a frost one so the finish on it is absolutely stunning. It's absolutely gorgeous and it just screams fall to me. For a more cheaper kind of look you can also go for the Maybelline quad and I absolutely love this on the back it has the shades numbered and it tells you how to do your own eye makeup look with it but obviously you can use it however you want but if you do follow the look on the back it does give you a gorgeous gorgeous eyeshadow look and mine is in the shade coral drama so it is gorgeous it's got a nice dark kind of plummy burgundy color more of like a bright pink a gorgeous gold and a shimmery white color as well it's honestly stunning and so affordable too now on to cream pots which will obviously last you throughout the day. The first two are the Maybelline 24 hour colour tattoos and the first one is in the shade Permanent Top and this is really, really nice as a base colour and it's also really nice just have a, like a white, a light wash across your lid and maybe a sparkle in the inner bit or even in like the centre of your lid as well. Um, it's just really nice and it does last all day as well. Definitely lives up to the 24 hour name. The other one which just screams fall to me again is the metallic pomegranate version of this and this is just stunning. It's got really nice deep shimmers in it, it's like a burgundy pomegranate with like gold flecks in it, it is just gorgeous. And an oldie but a goodie is the Benefit Cream Pot and this is in the shade Busy Signal, you can't actually get this anymore but if you do have it you could definitely use it this time of the year. It's just gorgeous, like a coppery gold shimmery cream eyeshadow and it's just stunning. From this little kit that I've made up myself, it has two MAC shadows, MAC shadows on the top and four Benefit ones on the bottom. The top two are gorgeous and absolutely lovely for fall. The first one is Woodwinked which is just a gorgeous shimmery colour and when you blend it into your crease it kind of changes and gets a bit darker so it's a really good two in one. The one next to it is Brown Down and that one is just stunning just to put in the crease of any of these, especially with the pomegranate ones or even the matte cranberry, it's just gorgeous with it. And then these three colours here are really, really stunning especially if you're going to a Christmas party and you want to have a really nice gold lid, that is absolutely gorgeous. So I've got three little palettes left and the first one is by Estee Lauder, it's just like a duo palette but I just love the colours so it's got your like really really nice light champagne-y pinky kind of colour for all over your lid and then your crease colour which is this gorgeous like plummy kind of burnt kind of colour, it's just stunning, really really, really nice um, and this is in the shade Raisins and I actually got this because Zoella recommended it and I absolutely love it, I actually need to start wearing this one more often. And the next two are probably the most obvious and it is the Naked palette. So for Naked 2, which is what I've got on today, it's just stunning because it has so many glittery colours. It has your black in it, in it to bend through the crease. It's just really versatile. You can wear this all year round but because of the glitter, it is amazing to wear this time of the year. And then obviously the Naked 3 palette for more of your pinky kind of looks, more girly. This stunning colour here is called Trick or even Factory and Mugshot, they're gorgeous on the on the lid with a really nice dark colour in the crease for a really smoky eye and I just love it, I think Naked palettes are really really versatile all year round but especially Naked 2 is just full of glittery sh shades so if that's what you're missing in your collection I definitely recommend Naked 2. Thank you very much for watching part 2 of my trilogy, I hope you liked it, don't forget to subscribe for tomorrow which is our last day and is all about gorgeous gorgeous blushes for this time of the year i hope you liked it guys don't forget to leave some comments below on what eyeshadows you love this time of the year so i can check them out and i hope to see you next time